Nej, du skal have en øje for at gå med dit tårs, bror. I'm sorry, I couldn't help it. Dude, this is the fucking mission that I just hate. To the left, to the left. The, the, I don't remember. Okay, somewhat middle, somewhat middle. And then further up, further up. Oh god, oh god. And now I need to be fucking careful for the oh for the center <laughs> and for the right for the right. You went to the right, right? I went up. Up, up, up. Did you say up? Up. I said up. <laughs> it's closing. Wait, what? The uh, what? 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 Why is it? Why is it? Why is it? Oh god! Oh god! Wake up, Carver. There's a time to sleep. Damn it. We do not want to get to that part. Hurry, hurry. It didn't hurry. You can't have it. We gotta kill that thing. There's not enough ammo in the world. Then we'll have to make some up. Look, there's markers floating all around us. We can use this TK charging plate and throw them as weapons. Oh, yeah. Shine. No! <laughs> Alright, it's her. 
Yeah, see, I can't hit, no. <laughs> Come on, we've got a direct shot at it. Alright. Why not? That's fucking gay. I'm just gonna eat it. <laughs> Fat ass. We're gonna pull it down now. Isaac, we have to get to that island where the machine is. The codex is on it. There's no way to reach it. Wait. I'll stand on the TK. Yeah. Wait, try to drag it over. Sorry, man. It's one of that thing we'll cover. the fuck? Well... It's disgusting. Come on, Come on. Yeah. Get the fuck up, boys! So this is it, huh? We use that codex. Yeah. Oh, God. Bullshit. Bloody. Die here? No. But Earth? Get to tomorrow. No! What the fuck? Thanks! Stop flying. Come on, Kawa gets like to pick him up on his thruster things. Come on, Isaac. <laughs> time for one last fap. <laughs> it's time to fap. No, oh, he's dead now. No, no. Mm. No. yourselves I was hoping she would die and there's just Isaac who dies what the fuck oh plot twist Isaac Isaac come on Kava. are you there Kava Isaac, you're gone, aren't you? Yep. <laughs> they can take him out of the story. Just don't kill him. God damn it! The Mark Sigma has gone too. Isaac, you did it. <laughs> you really did it. Come on, Carver, you've got him somewhere, you have to. Earth space coordinates confirmed. Shock drive enabled. Standing by. That's still a skip. He's dead, bro. Well, thank you for what? Wait. <laughs> He's probably not dead. Yes. Well, this just ruined the entire game. Oh. Well, 
Well, as I said before, thank you for watching and... Shut up, it isn't done yet! <laughs> <laughs> Fucking faggot. Oh, you're getting mad now. Cry, baby. Faggot. <laughs> It's almost 5 a.m. Twinkle, twinkle, little star. Did you still there? What? Oh, you're still there. Yep.
God fucking damn it. This is taking so long. Yeah. What you laughing at? Oh, no. J. A. Saint Stephen Mars. <laughs> Jean Claude Sachon. Thomas Sacolz. <laughs> Philippe Bossa. <laughs> <laughs> Philippe Catore. Philippe Bosso. Again and again, Melusi Maurizio, Germano Alessandro, Ferri Renzo. Yeah, yeah. Valentin Misillu Ma- Mas- Mas- Ma- Jeg kan ikke udtale det der Det er ret fedt der med, at de har det som de der aliens, rigtig writings der først. Ja, yeah, og de har også, altså det, jeg har set det samme tegn, som jeg også ser det samme på der. Så det er ligesom deres egen lille de mm. alfabet, de har fået der. Nice. Så det der O, oh, det er altid sådan M, sådan Adam. Det er der fede musik ind. <laughs> Good girl. Så er der de der små beskeder til sidst. For mig er det bro, og min personal legend, Kuntia. <laughs> Love you babe, Kate, Kao og Kyle Lager. Merry Christmas, James McCone. This one's for you. Shane, thanks, Christina, Jake, Megan, and Allison. Susan and Alex, my two favorite girls. <laughs> <laughs> to Isaac Clark and the MOM for introducing us. <laughs>
Ellie? Yes. Ellie. Who's gonna die out there anyway? Says who? New game plus have been on like front end Dead Space Legends suit set now. We're able to suit class uh, 3 SPD second set available at the bench. Uh, I'm glad he isn't dead. Now what? <laughs> well, I don't know. I mean, I mean what, what's the next game going to be? Him getting back? I mean, I, I believe they said that this was the final game. I mean, they at least said, I, in, in all the new kind of uh, reports, reviews about it, they said, Isaac, we need you for one last game. I mean, they said this is what, this would be the last game where he would be. At least that's what I understood. Apparently it isn't. It could be. It could be that someone else is going out to save, save him somehow. Uh, no, I think it's. I think it's uh, the last game. He's probably gonna die out there in space, anyways. Seriously, after what he's just been through, he's just going to die. Yeah. Seriously, there's still the little skip thing. I mean, there's probably a lot of things that he could do in order to get around. So why not? Dude, mm -hmm. we actually got all the artifacts and all the all the things we did except for the prologue in the beginning. We didn't get that finished? No, no, no. What? The AV-94 has killed 21 human enemies with headshots. What did you say about it? We didn't get it finished or what? We we missed one artifact in the in the prologue. 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 Yeah, that's <laughs> what I meant to say. <laughs> I definitely wouldn't mind them creating another game with him. It's a shame they didn't make it a little bit more out of it. Maybe something like Ellie? Ellie and then suddenly him talking to Carver. Carver, I can't reach her. Try, keep trying or something like that. That They will have a ability stuff about Ellie. Ellie. That would have been better if it, if it had been like he was trying to contact Ellie and then trying to like say something to Carver. Well, we still got impossible back, and I didn't think hard was very hard. Dog test a little. Yeah. Um, I've only got the. Uh, uh, yeah, I've got new playing cast, new game plus, and then it's like, start a new game to spirit of the original Death Space. Only classic weapons can be built. We have blueprints, co-op plays, disable classic aiming. It's enabled. Difficulty level is hard. Unlocks the devil horns. Okay, pure survival. Start a new game where resource management is key. Enemies will not drop health or ammo. Everything must be crafted at the bench. Difficulty level is hard. Unlocks the MK2 overclock parts set and make a resource. Start a new game that's not for the faint of heart. You must beat the entire game without dying. You can you can save and continue playing, but death will reset you to the very beginning. Unlocks ritual mode. Wow. What? Um. The yeah, okay. <laughs> the devil's horns at, at this moment. No that. idea. De either a weapon or a suit. I, I don't know. I, I would guess a weapon actually. So, yeah. Should Good we call point. that a day? Yeah. It's, it's actually 8 before 5. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. That was the Dead Space 3 walkthrough. Actually, kind of good. I was about to keep be disappointed about the ending, and I am a little bit, but at least Isaac isn't dead. I wouldn't mind if there would be another game with him. This was actually pretty great. I mean, it wasn't exactly that scary. I believe that if uh, Alex hadn't been there, it would probably also have been a lot scarier. But... Yeah. I actually think it was definitely quite good. 
I mean, it was definitely yeah, fun. Yeah, me too. It was a little, there was a little bit delay. I mean, when with the plasma cutter, it would ha have to take two shots in order to take the, sh the leg off a necromorph. But when it was with you, I would actually be able to see that if I shot once and I shot twice, there would actually go like at least three split seconds before the, the it would actually fall because of its leg had been cut off. It wasn't exactly long, but it was definitely noticeable, different from all the other games. Like, if you would shoot twice at this leg there, it would just fall directly after the second shot. But in this game, it would go 3 nanoseconds before it would fall. But again, uh, of course, it was still pretty damn good. I mean, the weapons were actually a little bit off. It was great that you could able actually create all those weapons. But I would actually... Yeah, most of the things were probably just that... They didn't have much ammo in them. I mean, all the other weapons had the same amount, but apparently the freaking pulse rifle that is key to my survival has barely anything. And also the line cutter, it used to be very, very effective. It's actually not that effective anymore, I will say. I mean, the javelin in the, in the second game, you, if you had it upgraded completely, it would be seriously good. But the line gun would actually be even better, in my opinion. Of course, in this game, it is a little bit different. The line cutter isn't that good, but the javelin is fucking perfect. And that's just my things on that. Also, again, it was a little bit annoying that they didn't have the note thing. It was actually pretty great that you could upgrade your suit, your rig, your air, and all that using all the scrap metal, the uh, tungsten, and the uh, transducer, and all the th stuff. I don't, rec I don't remember. It was the Medigel, which is used to upgrade the rig, but anyway, um, there, those um, upgrades for the weapons were actually a little bit more off, I think. I mean, they could have used nodes for them, perhaps, because the thing that you can only add, like, four upgrades to it, and that was, like, increased damage, and you have to get, like, those advanced uh, things that'll give, like, two plus fire rate and two plus damage. It's a little bit, eh. Th then I would actually prefer the nodes. To that, I mean, there could still be other things in order to create the items, uh, in order to crew upgrade the suit and all that. But the notes maybe could be a little bit different uh, with the weapons. There could maybe be notes for that. Yeah, the suits were actually pretty great. It was a little bit annoying. There wasn't exactly that many suits. I mean, pretty much the only kind. I mean, if it hadn't been for all the downloadable, it would only be like all in all three different suits, perhaps uh, three, four. Yeah, three different suits because the other ones are actually identical to the ones that the other person has. <coughs> so yeah, all in all you will actually have like five. Five different suits, but it will just... The first one uh, would just be the one starter one. The one that Isaac would get the EVA suit and John Carver suit, the Special Forces suit. The second one would then be each... Uh, would actually be the one you already have. Pretty much. The one that I... Uh, actually, that's not true. You would get a second suit then, and then the next suit you would get would be ch changing the suits, pretty much. Uh, the one that uh, Cl uh, Clark had gotten and the one that Kava had gotten, they would pretty much change suits. So Isaac got the one that Kava had, and Kava got the one that Isaac had. Then they would both get a new suit, again, different from each other. But as we saw again later on, it would be changed so that... Carver would just get i6 and i6 would get Carvers. Of course, the only difference that would be would be the color. Type would pretty much be the same. I mean, in the other games, they had like seven suits at least for just one person. And they were pretty much never identical, uh, except for the first game, of course. There were five engineer suits in the beginning that you could only upgrade. The only thing you would pretty much upgrade was the air and the armor. And then in the end, you would get like a military suit. And in the second one, you would actually be able to get security suits, engineer suits, uh, special suits made for something, I can't remember what. You would get a vintage suit, I remember. So it was a little bit more diff different, and especially this one, but I believe it was still a incredibly good, good, good thing, pretty much. Good thing. Norton was an asshole, of course. That was not come as a surprise. I actually thought that it would be the necromorph thing that would have gotten to him. Like, he would start seeing in his mind that Isaac was cheating, uh, or they was cheating with Isaac, something like that. I, I thought it was more uh, the, the sickness that would get to him. Like, th that would be a perfect moment for the sickness to try to take over Norton. Because, 
it, it was probably su su suddenly getting happy for Isaac being back and all that. And then I guess I had guessed that the sickness would like be like he, he's trying to take her over. You have to stop him. That that's what I had in my mind. But of course, but it wasn't. But he was still an ass, of course. And what uh, Avi did when he shot him in the head had to be done. He was an ass, no matter what. But yeah, I'm glad that Ellie survived. I mean, it would have been really fucking annoying if he had died. It would really ruin the story that all the ones that are there just suddenly die. I mean, they can they can leave the story perhaps, but then it can't be in the game itself. They cannot die. I mean, maybe they could die, but then again, we have to have created a new bond with a new character. That is, for example, for the next game, instead of it being Isaac, it could perhaps be Carver. Bikaba who returned home to Ellie to tell her unfortunately that Isaac had died during their escape from the planet something like that Because now we've created that bond with I uh, with Carver So that that would actually be okay, but you cannot like be yeah, he's dead now too fucking bad Then it has to be like somewhere you already created a bond with somebody else and then like yeah He died unfortunately due to that and that Yeah, that that's just that's just my opinion on it. So Bye, I guess.